Daniel, about the Oscars coming up Sunday. Usually, if it's the Oscars or the Super Bowl, all the other television stations, all the channels, say, forget it, we're going to do reruns. We wouldn't compete in any way with the Oscars. You know who is on stage at the Celebrity Theater uh, Sunday night, and it's going to be packed? James Von Prong. I bet. <laughs> You're a courageous son of a gun. <laughs> well, I already know who's going to win, so I mean, why should I watch him? <laughs> You pack them in all the time. <laughs> Listen, you regularly have conversations with the departed. And as many times as we've talked, radio and television, I've never asked you this simple question. What do they tell you that heaven is like? They say heaven is exactly what you made it while you lived on the earth. So the amount of love that you made here is what you bring over. So you really create your own heaven or hell based upon how you treated people and thoughts that you created and the world that you made here, you'll bring it with you. So. So for me, it's going to be a big restaurant. A big restaurant, probably a theater in the air, you know, something like that. And if, if you, uh, for instance, if you were down there on the earth and you had an ability to want to play the piano, but you never had that opportunity, in the spirit world, you're able to do those things. Well, Anything I have you want to, to do. Well, I have to practice up there, too. No practice. You'll just, oh. your natural creative oh. energy and talent oh. comes out. Energy coming out of the fingers. Yeah. James Von Prock, listen, tell me about Sunday night. What can people expect? Uh, Sunday, is, is, for people who've never seen it before, it's a pretty incredible experience and it's a life changer. And that I come out and explain what happens when you die, what happens when the soul leaves the body. And I explain about spirit communication, exactly how that works. And then I'll do messages for people in the audience, all over the audience. And I'll do a, probably a little brief meditation just to guide people. And after the show, people should come up to me and say, wow, that changed my life. So that's what we can expect. What time? Uh, two o'clock is starting, I believe, too. They should be there early, so two o'clock. Oh, so... That's uh, early. They can so go home and catch the Oscars. About, well, we, a, two to five. A, a double header for Clay Yeah, Mount. come on. It's great to start with the Oscars. James Von Prague I'll and the Reverend. champagne with them if they want. <laughs> All right. Now, listen. Is, is it not humbly enough to be the, the biggest guy in your field... And now you got to open a school? I had to open a school. I opened a school. I worked about a year and a half on that. James Von Prague School of Mystical Arts. I must tell you, it sounds like Hogwarts. That's exactly right. That's what I kind of <laughs> wanted to make a gear toward, because it's just like that. It's uh, six weeks of uh, intense uh, psychic intuitive uh, work, uh, exercises and classes. And I do a lot of work with these people online. And then uh, I also do a mediumship course, six-week course. And it's, it's grueling for some people, but it's real good stuff. It's basic, good, fundamental learning, the right way of learning the methods of how to communicate, how to feel energy. Uh, one exercise, I have people go to a shopping mall, and they have to sit there and try to tune into the light around a person, what's the color of that person person, what's that soul makeup of that person? The aura? The aura, and then go deeper into the soul fabric. What, what's their intention? Where do they come from? It's, it's good. But what you mean, it's good if you're, if you're gifted as, as a psychic or as a, as a mystic, uh, a medium, uh, an intuitive, but what happens if we don't have those gifts? Everybody is intuitive. Everyone's psychic from one degree. You know this. You're psychic. Uh, everyone is intuitive from one degree or another. We're born with intuition. That intuition means into the soul. So we come back with that sixth sense. Uh, small children are very intuitive. Probably to the age around seven or eight, and they kind of shut it off, and they listen to the adults, and then they get in trouble. But really, we all have that intuition, and the more you nurture it, the further it can go. So this school is really for those to help nurture their natural state of being, and really just giving people the permission to be who they are, be you know, that sensitive, feel energy. Well, we can feel energy all the time. You know, we all have that when you, when you think of someone, the phone rings, and it's that person. Yeah. That's your intuition. Things like that happen all the time. Do you mind if I take just a moment? Because no. I have never really felt as if... I had the same kind of gifts that you do. Uh, or Melinda Vale was here uh, yeah. just a few days ago. Uh, she's one of the best there. One is. of the best, well gifted. Yes. But in order, in order to to test what you just said, I want to see if I can pick up anything. Okay, okay? ready? I just got please it. Stand I, know, I, I know he's going to say. So Hold on. I just feel it. I see an ocean. I <laughs> Wait a minute. I see a man my size laughing. This is true. Uh, no, that's right. you. You're good. Uh, <laughs> I see sailboats. Yes. And I see wow. two boras. Oh, <laughs> Bora Bora. Amazing. <laughs> Just a second. I'm talking about Tahiti. Tahiti. Why would I be getting Why that would you from be you? Why up on Tahiti? Wow. Uh, well, well, it just so happens that in July, I'm going to Tahiti. Get out of here. Yeah. Amazing how you did that. Wow. Yeah, I'm bringing 100 people to Tahiti. I, it's my 27th cruise. 
And um, it, I just do them just for healing cruises. I don't have to do these. But we have such a great time with, I'm doing a healing week in Tahiti for just 100 people. And we have our own island. We do all this incredible work together. And people's, again, lives have changed in many ways. Healing an emotional, spiritual, mental, and physical being. James Von <laughs> Prague so. doing all you come. You're welcome of that come. work on a Tahitian island. You it and doesn't Duffy get should, much better. You and Duffy can come. No, that's terrific. Well, we went, and, and when I went swimming with the sharks, yeah. I was 6'3 before that. <laughs> Look what happened. Uh, by the way, when is the cruise? July. It's in July. It's on my website. Uh, www.vanprog.com. So it's all there, all the information. What about the appearance now, Sunday night? Sunday, yes, it's a celebrity theater. And uh, that also is on my website or at celebrity theater on my Facebook page. And there's still tickets available for people. Here's another one I've never asked you. And I'm sure other people have. But I know that you've been in touch with celebrities. Uh, Marilyn Monroe is one and, and so on. And I don't know whether you can just all of a sudden call upon one. But has anybody ever given you any information about the assassination of Kennedy? Yes. And Mar yeah, Marilyn Monroe's come through, John Kennedy's come through. Okay, 30 ben seconds though, what did they tell you about JFK? That it was an inside job. CIA with another, you know, group. Would you do me a favor now? Because we've been friends for a while. Don't start your car when you go out <laughs> in the parking lot, okay? Why, well, there's a better place to go to. Sunday, <laughs> Celebrity Theater. Celebrity Theater Sunday. In the afternoon. In the afternoon. It's a matinee. You know, it's terrific. I mean, you could spend a day with, then you could spend a cruise, and you could go to the school with James Bond. You know what? You may never get rid of this guy. It's true. Uh, and it's okay because you can let him come down and visit us every once in a while on the morning scramble.